Eggs and avocado for breakfast. Is eating two eggs and half a avocado a good breakfast to have every day? Avocados are technically a fruit, but they function in the way that nuts and coconuts do. More as a healthy fat. Due to their nutrient macro breakdown, you might consider including some other fruit or veg to balance this out a bit. It's not unhealthy as long as you are getting the rest of your fruit, veg, and fiber throughout the day. It's hard to pull out one meal and determine if it's healthy. Because what's healthy is relative and depends on your health goals and your whole diet. There are good things about eggs and avocado. There are some other considerations too. Including calories in avocado if calories are a factor in your health goals. But it's very possible to have a healthy diet that includes both eggs and avocado. Yes, both are a great source of healthy fats which help regulate your hormone levels. Eggs have a bit of protein too which is an added bonus. I'd say that instead of eating the same meal on repeat you should eat a variety of foods. Eat across the rainbow, as they say. Perhaps not daily but I eat eggs and avocado and toast probably 3-4 days a week. It's my favorite. I just have family members in my ear chirping at me that eggs are bad because of cholesterol. Every now and then? Yes. Every day? No you can't limit yourself to one food group there are many nutrients you'll be missing if you do. The same food groups every day. Otherwise you'll need to take supplements to fill in what you're lacking in your diet. Absolutely just balance out the rest of your day's macros micros. I do keto so this is a great way for me to get my fats. And you should look into slug slime for your avocado to make it extra delicious. Just have six eggs. Throw in some roasted asparagus and or spinach. Sounds great. It's a good source of protein and healthy fats. You might want to change it up sometimes so your diet doesn't get too repetitive. Healthy fats are great however if you're trying to lose weight eating lots of avocado you'll probably be fine if you're just eating half is not the way to go. You should OFC get some fats. I'm just saying there's a lot of calories in them. Eggs debatable. Don't let people tell you they are 100% safe or dangerous because we do not know yet. Avocado great if you're fine with caloric goals. I'd go eggs in moderation. You can switch it up with soft tofu or Greek yogurt for higher protein. Or mushrooms if you are getting enough protein already typical for Americans. As others have said, fresh and varied is best. I think that's a good base other people have mentioned variety if you have variety in your other meals it's probably fine. But to maximize nutrition you might consider adding some rotating vegetables here maybe a handful of massaged kale under your eggs and avo and top with a drizzle of balsamic or halved cherry tomatoes on the side or some fruit or top with pico de gallo and cilantro or cook up peppers and onions in the eggs. Every day I have eggs with mozzarella, asparagus, spinach, and tomatoes and avocado toast with everything bagel seasoning from TJ's. Red pepper chili flakes, cherry tomatoes, with a side parfait with blueberries, raspberries, dates raisins and sliced banana around the plate and I never ever 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 get tired of it. Eat what makes you happy. I know my breakfast makes me feel full for the day and I never get tired of it. It depends. There is a lot of fat in THST particular breakfast where it gets unhealthy as if you can't or don't balance out the fat. At the end of the day, fat is still fat. No matter what the original source of that fat is, that particular fact seems to elude a lot of so-called healthy eaters. Edit clarity. The egg industry would love you to think otherwise but eggs are actually not healthy for you. Chicken eggs are packed with enough cholesterol to sustain a baby chick 21 days without any outside nutrients. So, 
a lot of cholesterol. Swap for tofu scramble. You can make it with all the good stuff. Add some spinach for iron and calcium. Black beans for protein. And of course, keep the avocado. It's not bad, but doesn't have much fiber. Can you sneak some fruit or veg in there? Maybe throw some spinach in the eggs? Some melon or berries on the side? Just take a carrot or celery with you on your way to work? I have stomach issues so I can't have a big breakfast. So sometimes I'll save my fruit or veg to eat an hour or so later. 20 years ago I lost 25 of my body weight. 200 down to 150 pounds since then I've gained and lost many times. The highest I've gotten to over the years is around 178 pounds. When I have lost weight, it is usually with a lower carb approach. I always do best when eating eggs regularly for breakfast I am much less hungry over the course of the day. I know everyone is different, but they really work for me. 20 years later, today I weigh around 153. Conditioning your body with egg in preparation for a losing weight. Sounds amazing to me. I like getting some everything seeds putting them on avocado toast with one egg and some pepper flakes. Eating two eggs per day is absolutely not healthy. We as humans should not consume that much cholesterol at all far less in one meal. One egg has 187 milligrams of cholesterol. We are only to consume a maximum of 300 milligrams per day if any at all. Plant foods have no cholesterol which is interesting our bodies create all of the cholesterol we need. Check out Dynamics IV Health for more help. One egg yolk contains the maximum amount of bad cholesterol that you should eat in a day so maybe get rid of a yolk. Too much bad cholesterol can be very damaging.